Today we're going to hang a chicken on the Weber Smoky Mountain uh, Grill. Uh, we've done this before. Uh, we've done it with half a chicken only. So today we're going for it. We're going to do the uh, whole chicken. Uh, so stick with me and uh, let's see how this turns out. Alrighty, here we have the chimney and we've got the coals in there on fire and we're getting ready to take these to the Weber Smoky Mountain. Alrighty, I just dumped in the uh, charcoal into the Weber Smoky Mountain. And I'm using the, what you call the minion method where uh, I uh, put in a bunch of coals and then I put in the lit ones on top and it should light up the, the rest of the coals. Also, since we're hanging the chicken, I'm using as a safety precaution, this rack. I put this rack uh, on top of the coals there. So just in case the uh, chicken falls, it'll fall on the rack and not on the coals. Already we have the Weber Mountain, Smoky Mountain, um, all assembled. And I got this uh, chicken uh, hanging adapter here and it's ready to go. So I'm just gonna wait for it to come to temp. Already as you can see, the Weber Smoky Mountain is coming up to temp. I'm gonna go get the chicken and get it ready to go. Alrighty, here we have our chicken, which has been seasoned beautifully, and we're getting ready to hang it. And here we have our traditional Killer Hogs, the AP rub, Killer Hogs of barbecue, but I also used Weber ki Kicking Chicken. That seasoning is really good. It gives it a good kick, good flavor. Here we have the, the chicken uh, prepared, ready to get the, to the Weber Smoky Mountain. And I'm gloving up. Um, so that I can uh, go ahead and put in this adapter. So basically, it's this adapter right here. The chicken has been hung on the Weber Smoky Mountain. And now all there is is just to wait a couple hours. Um, we're gonna do this cook at about 250, 300. Uh, and I'll let you know how it turns out. All right, everybody, we are a half hour in into this cook. And here's what our hung chicken looks like. So far, so good. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, spray some uh, wine on this just to keep it moist and uh, we'll take a temperature. Alrighty this thing has done a great job at keeping its temperature here about uh, 340. Uh, it's been holding steady and uh, the alarm just beeped so it's telling me that the uh, temperature's uh, at 150 so let's check it out. Wow look at how this chicken is churning out it's just beautiful to do that. One more spray bit moist and I'm gonna come around so that you can see here we go spray it some more but this is just beautiful so far this is my third uh experience hanging food on the Weber Smoky Mountain and I gotta say it is outstanding I'll be back with you when uh ready to take this chicken off but so far so good alrighty this thing is beeping and I don't know if you can see it but it's telling me it's 175 165 it's ready I usually like taking it to 170 just to make sure the whole bird is done but look at this it is done I'm getting ready to pull this bad boy out hey everybody this thing is beeping that means it's up to temperature it out and see it. First of all, let's take out the probe. There we go. We'll probe this out. We're gonna pull out this beautiful chicken for you. Look at this thing. Is that beautiful or what? I was gonna barbecue it, but you know what? I'm just leaving it like that. That looks too good to put barbecue sauce on it. So. Look how easy it is to take this adapter off. There it is. The adapter is off. Now we're going to take it in and uh, cut it off. Um. Okay guys, the chicken has been carved and it's been served.